Hello and welcome to never take a look at a game called Settlements. This is developed by Treyon Games and it has been in Steam Early Access since early February of this year. I actually got a key for this one back then. I tried it out back then uh, and it just it wasn't quite ready for uh, showing here. However, I've been keeping an eye on it and uh, I really like the idea of the game and I think it's probably gotten to the point to where we can show it off and uh, get an idea of what's going on here. So the game is, it's a base builder. Um, the idea, though, is we're going to be going from the, the Stone Age all the way up, slowly, up to the Space Age, starting out by building just wooden shacks and lumberjacks and stone mills, eventually getting mines in that stone mill, stone mine, I mean, uh, getting iron mines and things like that built up to slowly getting new tech and crafting new things and sending our people out to go find things and bring it back and, and try to build up a civilization. The story goes, uh, I think this is actually in the future, and civilization has fallen apart. Uh, we've got little pockets of, of, of clear land that we can actually build these settlements up. And that's where we, where we begin. So uh, anyway, let's go ahead and try this one out and see what it is all about. Um, it's very interesting. I should mention, uh, coming from a Dwarf Fortress player, this, this may mean something. But the UI or the, yeah, just the, the UI, the graphics, is all kind of terrible. Um... But the uh, the idea here in the in, in the gameplay here is is uh, is something. So keep that in mind. Uh, so yeah, this is kind of giving us an idea. The world's covered in thick bramble, which makes it impossible for us to to live in one place. Make a lot of people live in one place. However, we have just discovered two of them. One is amazing. Two is fate. We found a couple spots that we can actually build up a place and get some people uh, here and uh, getting ourselves. A, uh, a city going. Now I mentioned, remember, graphics terrible, UI terrible, but gameplay good, so hang in there. So we've got six spots, or you can't really see them, but there's six spots and a, a town center here. Um, in these spots, we can choose to build things like houses and lumberjacks and things like that. Um, we actually have two towns, two openings, not a town yet, there's no one here, um, to build things. So let's go pick a spot here. We're gonna build ourselves a shack. And slowly, over time, this shack will be produced for free. We don't have to use anything. We just grab a bunch of sticks, throw it together, and we'll get ourselves a shack. When you get a shack, you get a villager. These villagers all have different stats. They have different uh, abilities and skills that will, uh, over time, progress. Um, uh, we've unlocked some things. Woodcutters, gatherers, stonecutters, crafters, and hermit hut, which is like research, have all been unlocked now since we now have Tatiana Spencer here. Tatiana is uh, a very wise Tatiana. She has no skills at the moment. Um, and she has nothing, no gear at the moment. We could, well, eventually we'll send these people out questing over the land and trying to find things and bring back gear, find new spots for settlements. As you can see, all of our abilities over here as well. Um, let's look at the world map real quick. So here's our two settlements. We have a massive map here. We'll eventually go scouting out and finding new settlements and finding new things. But for right now, we just got this one spot with one old Tatiana here. Uh, let's get a few more houses built. Let's throw in like three houses. And we're going to throw three houses in on, on both of these spots. The houses up here. This will allow me three villagers on each side. Now with Tatiana here, what do we do with her? Um, well, we put things in like a woodcutter. And we want to be able to make the thing. So we have to go tell Tatiana, Tatiana, come here and go make me a woodcutter. She has to go and actually do some work. We also have Talia over here as well and Darla as well. This is the female camp, I guess. And, uh, no, this is, we're all females, okay, okay, the population won't be growing very fast. Uh, but Tatiana's gonna work on the woodcutter, and eventually she'll get this done, which is now done. We need a lot of wood, okay, so Tatiana, we're gonna get somebody that's gonna go in here and do some wood chopping. We want somebody that's strong, right, we gotta swing an axe. So, we've got, Darla here is a four, what was Tatiana? She's a three. You can see she's already gained a skill in construction because she's been, bu she built a bunch of trees. Uh, so let's get Darla here to go work on this one. So Darla now will slowly, over time, bring wood into the camp. We don't have a use for wood just yet, but we'll get there. Um, we also want to make sure we get a, ourselves a stone cutter here. I'm going to go ahead and put a gatherer in here as well. So stone cutters give me stone, gatherers give me food. Um, food isn't used like you would think. People don't actually eat the food. The food is used for research, which we'll get to in a bit. Uh, there's a lot of, of things over here. Um, we'll get to, we'll get to all this stuff as, as we get to it. Um, so we'll slowly try to make our way and try to explain what all's going on here. Um, we, you will see, oh, there's a quarry. So go ahead and work over here. And uh, we got a gatherer now. So, Ta Talia, go, go give me some gatherers. So, so resources will start popping in here now. We also got ten coins because we 
completed a task. Excellent. Next task is to make some stone tools. So let's go ahead and do that. Over here to the glade. We have three people here. Lexi, Ruthie, and Flick, who are doing absolutely nothing. So we want them to be doing something. So let's go ahead and make ourselves a crafting hut and a hermit hut. That is my uh, my researcher. You can see here we're in Stone Age right now. We'll eventually make our way up to the early Bronze Age, which we don't know yet. Late right. We can go all the way up slowly into the Space Age. Eventually. It'll take a little while, but we'll eventually get there. Um, and we'll get you guys to come in here and start working on some things. Get this stuff. We can put two people in here to get them constructed faster if we want. Resources are gathered up top here. We can see that. And they'll get used. You can see here we need we need ten wood and four stone to make this crafting hut. Luckily, we've got folks over there in the other village making this stuff, so we can get the thing made rather quickly. Um, and we got uh, Darla's gaining lumberjack skills. Excellent. New research unlocked. Old age coins, fruit and veg. We'll see that in a minute. So we have a crafter now. So someone needs to go and be a crafter. I'm not sure exactly what stat crafting is need. What needs crafting? I'm not entirely sure. Um, no. Does it say? Uh, no, it doesn't. So we're gonna have to just figure it out. So we're gonna grab, uh, we'll grab Lexi here. Lexi, sure. Come here, Lexi. You're going to be a crafter. What do I want you to make? I want you to make some stone tools. They're gonna take two stone and one wood to make. You can see we make things like clubs and shields and wicker jackets as well. We'll eventually work our way up into tin breastplates um, and uh, and new fancier things as time goes on. You can see we work our way up. We Early Bronze Age start looking at things like meat to fruit. What? I'm not sure what that means, but whatever. Uh, heavy furs and wolf helms and battle axes and stuff like that. But for right now, we're going to make ourselves some tools for our villagers. Uh, Ruthie, I want you to go ahead. Actually, we need someone who's smart. Um, Flick is, re is decent. So Flick, I want you to go ahead and be my researcher. So this is where we learn to make things. We can learn how to make wicker jackets. We can learn how to make better houses. Which is what we want to do. We can turn these shacks into proper houses, which gives us more people. Um, I want you to go ahead and help out and keep on crafting things. We actually made some tools. I'm going to make a few more tools to put on multi-run. Just, just keep making tools. Because we can come over here to the dawn to uh, Darla here. Darla, I would like to give you a tool. This will allow you to, I think this allows you to hack wood faster. And allows you to uh, bring, well, bring wood in faster because you have tools now. Makes sense. We got more tools gathering up here and keep on giving them to our people uh, like you. I have a tool. You see all kinds of different things we can we can give our people. Which we're going to start sending up a scouting party in a moment. And this will come in more important uh, in a moment. Um, you're working on houses right now. And you guys are working on still making some of those. So that's fine. So we're in good shape. Uh, we need to make four of these things to pass the uh, the task. Then we're going to go and start sending someone on a, uh, a scouting journey. So that's, uh, that's where we're at right now. We can see the world map. We've got... These two will send some folks out and hopefully find some things, is the plan. But yeah, this game is, um, well, it's really ugly. Uh, but potentially, I'm liking the idea here where it starts out really small and you slowly start working people up. They all have different abilities and you can start to send them out and doing, interest, doing different things and hopefully bringing in, finding things for you. Um, let's go ahead. We need to get a, someone who go out scouting, right? So we're going to go ahead and get a spear. Let's go ahead and bring ourselves, make ourselves a spear. Um, for somebody to go out and do some some uh, killing. So let's uh, make sure we research this uh, log cabin. And uh, I think we, we researched like houses and now we know how to make log. I'm not sure, entirely sure why it's in there twice. Uh, so we, we got one spear made, right? Uh, let's go ahead and make... Did we make a spear? No, we didn't make a spear. Make a spear. Make me a spear. There we go. Four stone... Two, uh, four, two stone, four wood to make a spear to get someone outside crafting. Uh, we have now done it. We have a stone spear has been made. Eventually, we'll pe maple will make like better things. We'll have better um, crafts and stuff like that. Uh, Lexi, do you need to have one of these? It makes sense that you would need to have some sort of tools being the crafter. So there you go. Have some of those. You see level two craftsman here in Ruthie. Made seven items. Researched one thing. Yeah. Uh, Hermit Hut is nearly, or the, uh, the, the, this thing is nearly done, which means we can now upgrade houses. So over here in the dawn, let's upgrade this shack. I'm going to tell Talia, come over here and start building this thing up to give us a bigger house, which gives us more people, and more people means that we can, uh, well, do more things. We have a trader here. We can sell you one of my tools if I want for 10 bucks. Sure, I'll sell you one. Um, I can... 
I can buy that for a lot of money. Which I'm not going to do, so there you go. Alright, back over here. Now, um, I want to make sure we start getting a wicker jacket as well. So for our, for our, um, our, uh, our scout. And let's work on getting metal lore, I think. Is what we want. We lowered, okay, so we, it was house design before. Then we actually get the right, the house to look at. There's a tech tree in here we can find eventually. Um, and we'll make a shield as well. So let's get someone that's going to go exploring. So we need someone, I'm going to grab someone from this side. Um... Strength is kind of low. How are you? Flick. I don't want to send Flick out. What about this side? Uh, your strength is terrible also. Anybody any good? Three. You're my farmer. How about you? Um. Alright. Darla it is. Darla. I want you to go ahead and grab yourself a spear. I'm going to give you a shield, and I'm going to give you this jacket, which we apparently have not made yet. Make me that. And you're going to go out and do some scouting. Hopefully you won't get attacked, and things will be peaceful. But just in case, I want you to go ahead and have you some gear here. So, uh, what's your name? Lane? Is that what it was? Shane. Shane, go make me another shack. There's more people in here. Maybe we'll get someone that can actually do some defending and all that. Make me grab with you one of these things. You've got, uh, I think you're ready to go. No helmets yet, but I want you to go and do some questing. So, away we go. Now, what do I want you doing? Do I want you going out and trying to find settlements? Do I want you trying to find items? Helping people? Uh, going on quests, which I'm not sure what this is. A slight increase in quest discovery. I'm not sure what that means. Uh, find bosses, uh, whatever. Uh, we're going to go and try to find another settlement, I guess. So, um, away you go. Go and scout. We can send more people off if we want to, but no, she's fine. Go and do it. All right, so away she goes. She is out scouting. Next is to uh, upgrade essential plot storage. Yeah, we can do that here. If we want to upgrade our storage to be able to handle more things. You can see we only have a 10 max right now. Um, no one's doing trees right now. Let's go ahead and do that. Upgrade that thing. And oh, we need more wood. Tilia, come over here for a minute. You guys, grab, grab some trees. Get some trees uh, done real quick. I uh, neglected my trees because we sent our tree lady into the woods. Alright, so I want you guys making me... Uh, make me a wicker basket so we can give that to our berry picker. Um, you can go ahead and work on... Oh, tin mine. Sure, get a tin mine. Our next thing we need to make is a tin breastplate, so we'll focus on getting that done, I guess. Um, okay, back over here. How are we looking over this way? Get that shack made. Wood's coming in. We need a lot of it for this. We need someone to come build this. Barbie is now here. Barbie, would you like to construct this for me. The King Rat has emerged on the world map. What does that mean? It's a boss encounter. Oh, okay. Okay, I haven't seen that before. Interesting. Alright. Doomsday. Um, I haven't got that either. So, interesting. <laughs> um, okay, so back over here. Uh, okay, so yeah, keep on making me some wicker baskets. We're gonna give it to our berry pickers. Give me a, a tin mine. We can certainly need that. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade one of these. One of you, Lexi, come make this thing. Um, so the game's... I guess you gotta really focus on trying to keep your people. Minding your uh, your people's abilities is a big part of this. Upgrade that one as well. Um, we have all our wood, so I'm gonna send Talia back this way. And... Oh, oh, you're... Uh, are you back? Did you return? Yeah, she did. She got three experience for... Okay, good job. Um, go do it again. Go, um... Go find me some items. Will ya? Do something productive. Yvette has joined us. Uh, over on this side. Right? Yeah, here's Yvette. Uh, Yvette is... Is... Average. Um, so go and, um... Oh, there we go. Our settlement's gonna be upgraded to take in four separate areas. Storage, defense, protection, supply. We saw that before when we select the middle. I want you to work on that. You can see different things we can upgrade here. Walls. Um, we can get better, I guess, building health? Oh, it's it's a health building. Gotcha. Guard posts, transport, and protect repair. So, uh, I've not been attacked before. I'm guessing that's a thing that happens, however. Uh, we need fruits and vegetables, which we don't have. Um, because people are doing nothing. Are you strong? Um, I'm gonna give you over here. You farmer, 
go and farm. And then, Shane, you are lousy. Do that. Oh, look at this guy. Um, I want you to go and lumberjack also. We have three lumberjackers. Stone cutting. Yeah, I need you back over here. There we go. So that, that'll be good. And then Darla is back. Darla, did you find anything? Returns with help required. What's that mean? Okay, we need to need a tin breastplate right now, which I think we can probably do. I want you to go and just, just sit at home for now. Um, let's make... Can I make one of these now? That's still coming in. We, food is now here. We can make a tin mine now. Let's do it. Um, you, Lexi, go build that. And then over on this side, we got stone coming in. What? Can I put you over here? No, no. It just tells me we can go up to 20 now on this stuff. And we have some coins around. And the trader is now here. Saw it pop up over here. Merchant Veil the Dark has arrived. Wishes to trade with me. Veil the Dark. Um... I really don't have anything to sell you. I have nothing to sell you. I can buy... What is that? Fire... Oh, tin ingots. And stone. No, I don't want any of this stuff. Uh, so the tin... The, the mine is now here. Let's go back over here. Uh, you know what? Get back out there. Anything, anything for you? No, nothing for you. Just, uh... Oh, I can give you a bucket. I'm not gonna give you a bucket. I can also give you a pet. Apparently we can get pets at some point. And helms. Uh, go back out there and... And I want you to... Yeah, do that. Please find something this time. Okay. Um, make me a... Maybe we can get another one. Oh, let's learn to make better shields. Or stone axes. Throwing spears. Make me throw throwing spears. That seems like an idea. Uh, and we all have this one over here. This There's a smelter. We have monster lore. Metal lore. Let's do the smelter. Sure. Um, Lexi? Work on the old mine over here. Bring me some tin ore in. There's some tin ore right there. We're going to need a smelter to, to smelt this stuff. I wonder if I should only have two houses over here. Oh, combat. Okay, excellent. Okay, so combat. Um, so we've got Darla here. Darla here is holding... What is that? It's ambush. I don't know what it is. So uh, here we are. It's Darla with a spear and, um, you know armor and all that. Begin combat. So, Darla versus the rat, I guess is what a, a sickly giant rat. So, I don't know how tough this thing is. My attack skill is zero. Strength plus twelve. I don't know if it's any good, but we're gonna attack it. We smacked him pretty good, and he didn't hit us. Smack him again! There we go. Yeah, we got this thing. Oh, maybe not. We got him! Victory combat one! It was thrilling. But now she's done it, she's gonna come back, and hopefully, she's gaining skills as well, so hopefully she'll get better at things. Um, there's a thing in here also, we can spend coins to reduce the monsters to spend diplomacy points. Click that. I'm not sure how that works. Full settlement assault, I'm not sure what that means either. Um, we saw this before, she's out scouting at the moment. Um, but yeah, so, let's go back and look over here. We also progress to the next settlement, which is something else we're trying to work on. And we need to make uh, some tin armor, right. Let's see if we can get that done. Um, it's right here, we need to get... Researchers, we need craftsman too. Also requires crafting of tin ingot. Uh, wait, what was that? Smelt tin. We want to learn how to smelt tin, yes. Um, and we're going to put a smelter here. I'm going to actually... If I remove this, someone will be homeless. I'm going to. Okay. Ruthie is now homeless. Um, sorry, Ruthie. Um, I'm going to upgrade this place. You go ahead and work on it, Ruthie. Give me a new house here so you can have a home. And then we're going to put a smelter in over here. And, um... Hey, work on that. Why can't you do it? You cannot work because you're homeless. Um, yeah. Alright, fine. Work over here. Uh, I want you making me some... How about a... Um, wooden shield seems like an idea. Okay, yeah, get that thing done, which is almost, it is almost done. Well, uh, not quite. It'll be done here in a second. Um, back over on this side. How are we looking over here? Stone, wood, it's all looking good. We actually have quite, pretty good resources over here. Um, I guess we could upgrade this thing if we wanted to. Um, I think we're in good shape. Maybe we need to start working on getting better houses. Uh, you're back again. Why don't you go back out there and go look for a settlement? We want to find that. 
Another settlement is what we want. Right now, we, we know nothing except for a giant rat out there somewhere. And a family under attack. Oh! I missed this completely. Scott returns with a report that a family is under attack, uh, attack from nearby monsters. Three rats and two vine imps. Up to four warriors can go clear them off. Let's do it! Let's do it. Um, I want to do it. Come back later. Okay. Um, so let's see here. You, craft me. I need another armor. Another shield, another spear. And we're going to get someone out, out there. And I will stop forgetting to give Talia here her bucket. Have a bucket. So you can pick these berries a little bit faster. Okay. And uh, you have a home now, so you can actually get some work done. I want you over here, building up my smelter. Uh, Ruthie, get into the mine. We switched these, we switched these, but that's fine. Make me a spear, please. My scout has returned. Darla is full health now. Uh, who's gonna be my other my other fighter? I mean, Lev looks like a fighter, but he's apparently not. Um, you're not very good. Anybody? I need strength. Strength. Well, she's okay, but not very dexterous. We're gonna give it to, 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 to Leah here. To Talia, not not to Talia. Uh, let's see. I want to give you armor. I should have a, a a spear coming in very soon, right? And I want to get a shield also to make that thing. Uh, you come come help. Oh, uh, go go smelt. I want you to make me some. Yeah, smelt some tin. There you go. Do it a bunch. You come help her out. Research. Let's work on some housing. Sure. We have a, uh, a shield now. We're going to give that to you, Talia. There you go. Have a spear. Okay. Looking good, right? Um, you even have a bucket. So we want to go and do some... Uh, I think we need to go here. Who was that? That's Talia, right? Oh, we got two of them now. Four dogs and three giant rats. We'll, wait later. We'll go back to the. We'll go to this one first. So you and you. Um, I feel like we should send someone else because we're probably gonna die. But that's fine. We're gonna do two of them. We can do this. Okay. Kill that thing first. How are we doing? We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. One rat down. Okay. There we go. Yes, the combat in this game. Edge of the th seat. Thrilling. <laughs> it's so exciting, I can't even say the word seat. Uh, Alright. One of those games that uh, you have to really um, not have a problem with, with lack of graphics. Which clearly, if you haven't spent any time with Wood Fortress, we know that that is fine. Darla, you hanging in there, buddy? Okay, there we go. We got this, we got this. Leave Darla alone. We can run away if we need to, but we don't need to. We did it. Combat one. Uh, that means we've saved people, right? I don't see it in here, but but we have sa helped the family. We did that. We got some gold for that. Uh, do the family? Do they? Do you have treasure? Oh, look at that! We got wood. We got a fine breastplate, gold coins, scouting book, a book. I'm not sure what to do with a book, but. We're coming back here, and... Do you want some monster lore? Um, Darla is in bad shape, but Darla deserves a fine tin breastplate. Because she did so well. Okay, here we go. We gained a diplomacy point. We gained a treasure reward. We reduced the doom clock by one point. Which, I don't know what that does, but uh, I'm a little... Someone ran immersion. No, no. I mean, I, I'm not familiar with a doom clock. I don't know what that does, but it seems like a scary thing. So Darla here, she will slowly heal. She's going to eat some food and slowly get her hit points back up. When she's ready to go, we'll send her back out. Um, I guess she can work while she's doing something. She can come and chop trees while she's hitting her, rather than just sitting in the around doing nothing. Um, are you researching this stuff? I guess we're getting there. Uh, and you want, I want you making me a tin skull cap. Yes, for Darla. We need to make a breastplate. That's one of our what things we need to make. But I think we're going to call it, a, call it a day here. I think we have shown off uh, uh, some of the games. So it's a very slow build, but 
we can eventually make our way up a long way. We've only just now gotten into the... Not even the early Bronze Age yet. Not even there yet. Um, where is... We have house design we can work on also, which we'll, we'll, we'll work on that. We'll see if we can get some house design done. Um, and then we can make ourselves, you know, get some sort of early Bronze Age stuff set up. But, uh, so yeah, so that's the game. Eventually we'll send out, we keep on sending scouts out and finding, hopefully finding things, is the idea here. There's our Doomsday status, which I guess we're doing okay. It's at zero right now. Um, with an increase in Doom if you flee from combat. What's it say? Uh, decline to help anyone or lose a fight, find a new settlement, I guess, moves it along, you can see the date is 2034 right now. So, um, alright, we're gonna call it a day here. Again, thanks again for watching. And, oh, oh, here's our scrapbook. Today we were attacked by vinelings. These strange plant folk only ever get aggressive when something causes extensive damage to the bramble. We're not sure what has got them so worked up, but I hope we see no more of them. Large numbers can be deadly. What about the other one? Uh, we got another one, didn't we? Yeah, here we go. Book of Slayer. We can see all the different things that are out there in the world. Um, we've got Bestiary, which we don't know much about. Um, what else? Progress book. Nope. All right. Anyway, thanks again for watching. Again, this is Settlements. It's available on Steam. I'll have a link below. You can check the thing out. And I will see you next time.